what is up everybody thank you guys for tuning back into my channel at bunny d93 so as i got what i don't know what's going on with these videos this lately oh goodness but um i think it's because it's night time and I have her in a DXT 425 two way shape L part and you can curl this but it does say 100% fiber so I'm a little skeptical but I just want to I just want to bump it just make it straight right there that's it it shows you the colors on the back hold on cause she she's screaming but um yes that's what I did a review well I did a first impression um on the video that i just did so go check that out i told you guys that i would wear it for those who are watching this video now for the haul thank you guys for tuning in again yeah okay so we went to mac we went to ross we went to route 21 and belk where else we went and i think this is marshall's yes and we went to marshall's and got some hair Woo. Whew. Okay, so from Marshalls, yes, I am still. I'm gonna work on this. I have to. I, I gotta get this down, cause yes, I'm gonna work out. But I wanted some help in just that particular area. It's the midsection that's just got me going on. You know, I gotta keep fixing this. Y'all know I don't like that hair in my face. But um, like I said, I do like this hair, cause it's mimicking the texture of my actual hair and the style that I had it when I was back in high school so okay so this is the V oh wait Valio Neoprene Waist Trimmer Target Training Support Shed Excess Water Burn Additional Calories Keep Muscles Warm and Limber and I got it for three fifty at Marshalls so this is like a waist center waist trimmer thingy thing I'm a jig and I think this one is machine washable because I was trying to make sure one of them, the one that I was going to get was machine washable. So, it's that little piece. Y'all see it? Like, we got to get it together. I need some hairspray. And like I said, some jam. So, yeah. Do y'all see my part? Yay! It's so natural. They did, they did their thing on this one. It's just some thin hair. But, you know, it's good though. It's sticking in the right places, like I said. So, got this for $3.50. I'm going to take it out so y'all can see what it looks like. It says Valio. Or Valio. And it's just this kind of stretchy, but yet not stretchy. Oh, what is it called? Like, it's got a constricting feel on it. The inside, it feels like a mat on the inside. So, it's kind of big around the back side. And then, like, around the waist area, it gets smaller. And it has Velcro as well. So, I'm guessing it can just... Yeah, it can just Velcro to anywhere on here. And just put it down. Put it on in there. Alright, so this is for the support. Uh, that's a big word. Yeah, I ain't even going to try to... Er ergonomically... Yep, design training accessories. That's what we gonna say. Um, I'll look that word up. All right, it's my mom how to pronounce that. Ergo, nomically, or ear. I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna stop. So that was three fifty from Marshalls. That's all I got from Marshalls. <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. So Ruth and was having a sale on their jury. It was two dollars. Those whoever did these people uh in hoover's jury wanted to put the things that weren't on sale with the things that were on sale so when i got stuff i actually had like what like 18 things because they was like two dollars and one dollars and i actually only came out with like what like six things so i was just like this is how i was looking to do like well why was it over there it shouldn't be under the sign that says two dollars and one dollar you need to move your crap okay move your stuff in T way, I'm saying, but I was kind of like, well, why is it sitting over there? Then, like, come on, dude, don't don't try to trick me. But um, 
Obviously they did, because when I got to the counter, who was bewildered? Not them! So, this was $2. You know you're going to like it. Bam! And it's silver. The statement necklace there. And let me... Let me try to keep my things organized here and get them back in the bag. So I got a lot of stuff. Why did he, he put these all in individual bags? I'm not doing it, y'all. These things is gonna get thrown. So this one comes with hashtag earrings, the little number sign, talking about I'm so fancy. You already know. Yeah. I just really like the earrings. They're just like, yes, boo, yes. So, says fancy. And let's see here. If I can get it out. These were all two dollars. And there's the ring is the only thing that's a dollar. This also has the hashtag earrings, the number sign. It says VIP, y'all. Bear and part and part. <laughs> oh goodness. Okay. I really like this VIP one. Cause I had been eyeing it ever since they got them at Route 21 along with this one. If I find it, it's in here somewhere. Hopefully it's next. Yes, it is. Along with the one that says Queen and it's like lips. Okay, it's tangled on. What are you tangled on? I don't want to break you, but I'm facing the snatch. Like, get it together. even get in there. Ugh. Just get mad at me. So these studs are amazing. They're little cute thingy things. And it says queen. I just love that. Yes. Yes. Queen y'all. Queen y'all. Alright. And this was the only thing, like I said, this was the only thing. This ring was the only thing that was a dollar that I got, let me say. I didn't see anything else that I liked in the dollar section. Or that I wanted to go through and unravel. There you go. Didn't feel like it that day. But I saw my necklaces, boy. Yes, I did. Alright, so that's all from Route 21. And he gave me some coupons. I need to go back and get a sweater. So I will be visiting Route 21 again because I have to go to work. And we're doing, like, tacky sweater today. So, yeah, it's got to be a tacky, crazy, creepy, horrible Christmas sweater. This is supposed to be funny. Okay. Let's get that. Like I keep saying, get that. Oh, the boy. Okay. So, from Belk, got this on sale because they had a pre-sale. And when I came back, like, at the end of the um night because I had to work. And I didn't feel like waking up at 5.30 and then be at work at 9.30. Even though the thing started at 6, I just didn't feel like getting up that early. So, this was actually $98. And this is the white small north slash south crossbody. And I got it in white. Excuse me, I already said that. Wow. But I got it for $72.99. Hopefully, y'all can see that. This is a Dooney, by the way. Dooney and Burke. I like Dooney and Burke and Coach and Louie and Michael Kors. But Dooney and Burke is my first love. So I like Dooney and Burke before I like anybody else. So the front here. This is a crossbody. This is just, just amazing. Oh, it's so cute. And I'm really, really into these little bitty purses right now because I have so many of these lately. So this is it. They didn't put the emblem on the front, but I'm fine. I know it's a doony, you know what I'm saying? Like, you ain't got to fool me, man. But it's on the back, but it just has the words. It doesn't have the duck. So, there you go. Um, That's the back, and the inside, the interior is red. There's like a pocket in the back, like if you want to put anything else, or like your phone. It's magnetized, so when I let it go down, it goes right back to the same spot I need to go to. Inside, it's also red. There is a key fob thingy majigger holder here as well, as in most Doonies are. Um, well, most recent Doonies, let me say. So the inside, 
you can see the emblem patchwork on the inside and the tag in there that proves it's real is also over here next to the key fob it's actually behind it that identity number that's behind that little tag and then there's another little flap here for smaller items or anything but um for this to be a little bit of purse it's kind of deep I didn't know it was actually that deep but I love this thing so $72.99 for this Jimmy that's what I got from Belk and also from Belk I got this bag by Steve Madden it was $30.25 I know it was $30 something but I feel like $30.25 was the exact price of how much it came up to because it was like 29 something but I'm really feeling these shaggy items clutches and purses because I'm into the western sea of look this year that's you know that's for the fall the new western or old western let me say but this is the white one I have a black one as well but it says love on it it's not as crazy like this one but it does have the fringe on it so and they were both the same price but the black one is somewhere else so, from Ross, like I said, I'm really into these little bitty purses. So, from Ross, I got, this was $7.99, this little quilted purse, and it's just so cute. The chain on it is gold, and then it's like got a little tassel on it, and it's like a round quilted purse. I just think that that is so cute like so when you put your stuff in there it'll start forming its shape but other than that I got it from Ross for $7.99 from $14 I don't know who is actually by perfect image so let's see what's the you know I didn't even I just bought I just literally just said oh my god yes and just bought the purse I didn't even like look on the inside to see if there's any um but it's not there's no other like pockets in here it's just straight baggage so that's that for $7.99 and it's kind of like a cream beige -ish, almost pinkish half whitish lamby color don't know how to describe that, but it's like a pastel. And then I got these boots. I didn't want to get the ones from Route 21 that were trying to mimic the actual Timberland boots because I want some Timberland boots. I need some Timberland boots in my life. Like, I, I need some Timberland boots ASAP. I want the Timberland boots with the cheetah print on it. But I think those are only sold online to only one person that you, you kind of iffy about them. You know what I mean? So I didn't want to get the ones from Route 21 that were mimicking Timberland boots and it didn't have the Timberland emblem emblem name I guess it didn't have the little name on it I didn't want to do that because you just don't do that down here like dude just don't even do that but um I'm gonna cut this little wire if I can to show you the boots that I did get because they remind me of Timberlands but yet not at the same time they remind me of like boots but still Timberlands and I think it's because of the strings they're yellow and red but the boots are tan they also came in black and I got these how much were these where's this freaking thing where did it go I think these were $21.99 yeah it was yeah it was $21.99 so this is how they look the side, the back, and the front. And see the inside. The inside got you to print, but it like unless I like pull the tongue out and, and do something. I'm gonna have to mimic it to like start staying down so the cheetah print can actually show, but I kinda like it up too. I wish the cheetah print was like right there. But these also came in black. So this is the shoe. Got these at Ross for $21.99. And this is a size 7. Yeah. 
And this is by Pink and Pepper. Yeah. Oop, wrong way. Nope, it was right way. I, yep, I think so. Pink and Pepper. that I've cut the tag on that. I'm wearing those bad days tomorrow. Mm, fix that. Okay. All right. Ah. Okay. Ah. Okay. So, that's all from Ross. So, I went to Bath and Body Works. This hair is getting on my mouth. This got that, excuse me y'all for my white viewers, it's got that white girl feel. Ooh, all right. So, when I went to Bath and Body Works, this was a long time. Like, this is how long overdue this haul is. Except for some of the stuff that I just got, so yeah. Um, Bath and Body Works had a half off table and like a half off sale of like some of their fall stuff. But, like this was half off. This is the Avocado Oil Malibu Radiance Whip Body Cream by the True Blue Spa. This stuff along with this actual Malibu Glow Body Shine with the Argon Oil in it. These were both half off. Or were they? Yeah, they were both half off from $15. So these things make us WOCs aka women of color look like a goddess okay do you get what i'm saying let me let me just show you guys let's open it first Ebony. i'm getting too excited here we go so it comes out like this um smells earthy there you go it's just giving like this golden sheen to your skin like it's not glittery at all. It's just literally it look I don't it looks like sun kissed skin. It looks like <clears throat> for us WOCs, we go for that youthful glow. It's very hard to show this right here. Do you see the difference? Like on my hand, you can see it. That kind of I guess tannish for those who are not WOCs. But on me, it's just giving me a golden glow. And it makes our skin look healthier than what it already is. There you go, Ebony. You said that. Ooh. Now, this one, I have never tried this one. But I was just like, when I tried it in the store, it has, it's lighter than this one. So... It's actually got the specks of sparklies in it. You see it? Those are the specks. This one has no specks in it. It just looks like your skin is just well oiled and you eat everything good and you get enough sun. But this one is the same thing, but it's got the sparklies in it. So that's the only difference and it's a little bit it comes out lighter than the actual glow body shine the whip body cream comes out lighter so those were half off this was half off it's the plum moscato fragrance mist that was fourteen dollars plum moscato and almond harvest that was half off as well and I got these for free because I had my coupons that was still running at the store. And it was like, um, you get a free mini signature collection. And they actually had the A Thousand Wishes already sitting up there at the front. This stuff smells amazing. It reminds me of the red. The pomegranate stuff that's in the red. Um, like the red collection that's in Bath and Body Works. It reminds me of that, but softer. So, I like it. So, I got it in the spray and two lotions. Because I had three of those little coupons that say you could get a free signature collection. So, I got three of these in the A Thousand Wishes. And I got this one, the Big Mist 
by a thousand wishes which was fourteen dollars originally but since I spent I had another coupon spend ten dollars what was it yeah spend ten dollars or more and I had the leap coupon and I could get something up to a fourteen dollar value which was this was fourteen dollars for free so I chose this a thousand wishes so I want to go back and get the a thousand wishes they have like a it's like the glitter dust in it like I'm a glitter person I like glitter but I don't like glitter on my face there you go I like glitter on my body <laughs> so that's all oh no it's not I got well two of them are gone but I got two winters these were 350 I got two winters of the um scent portables and I also got a sparkling icicles but Steve didn't like it so he took no, I got two winters, a sparkling icicle, and a fresh linen. And he took the fresh linen. So, yeah. This is sparkling amber. This was also half off from the fall collection. And it's a wallflower. So, that was $325. Because it was half off. Alright. So, I'm going to move on to my MAC stuff and my beauty supply stuff. And then we will be done. So from MAC, I went two trips. I have both receipts. Thank you, Jesus. So I got a treatment, which is the MAC Prep and Prime Skin Refined Zone Treatment. Excuse me, guys. I got the treatment. The treatment was $22. And I also got some concealer that I want to highlight with because I want a different concealer to highlight with because this one, the Prep and Prime by MAC, in the peach luster like she should she suggested this one but I was like I already have it and it's not being as light as I want it it's like matching my skin so this is the peach luster it it doesn't do what I want it to do yeah doesn't doesn't do what I want it to do I want it to actually lighten the light in that area so the match master concealer is what she suggested for me and I got it in number five it's gonna say match master concealer so the match master concealer was 21 and the treatment was 22 so this is the concealer this is what it looks like and it's a 54 is also on there but it says match master concealer I'm gonna show you this is the exact color like when she did it I said yep so how much is it like that's how light I want it to be and then when I blend it yeah and see I'm gonna highlight with this like I'm not gonna put it all over my face you can't even see it no more but that's some good stuff because it didn't feel um heavy even though it's a cream it doesn't feel heavy and I hate heavy makeup like that's the only thing I hate so that was the packaging this one was 21 and the treatment which is the skin refined zone treatment this is for those with oily skin that even when you put like moisturizer on you put this on after your moisturizer looks like that got a little nozzle on there this was 22 it prevents the oil from ever coming through so it's like a um a, it's a primer and it dries that's what I love about this this oil but um you can also put it on top of your makeup if you didn't put any on but if I feel like if I haven't tried it on up under my makeup yet but she did it and I had makeup on and she just took a sponge put it on the freaking sponge and just dabbed around my nose and it was dry like it was gone I was like how much is the stuff oh my gosh like I have makeup on and you got the oil off of my makeup and below my skin because when I wiped my skin it was no oil so this this is some stuff right here and it dries to a matte finish and you can't really like tell it but my hand is like dry it's not moist as it is over here this part is dry so 
this is the package for that one. The Prep and Prime Skin Refined Zone Treatment. Got the little sparklies on it from the Prep and Prime collection. And this was $22 from MAC. So I'm going to be using that. So next trip when I went back to MAC, I'm really feeling this hair, y'all. Like I'm feeling it. I'm just going to bump it because uh, I need that to stay straight. Yes, if it stays straight, we're going to be in the clear. It's like these these strands here. No, that's too long. Okay. So I got, yes, I, I, I did. I broke down and I got the Rihanna Viva Glam Rihanna number two. I didn't really want the number one. It wasn't appealing to me. But this one, since it was so weird, I had to get it. I had to understand what was going on and how can I just want to understand so this is the Viva Glam Rihanna 2 and it's like this brownish mauve with silver flecks in it and it is a frost yes that's how like yeah this is a frost and please do not be alarmed all you need is like a berry colored lipstick not lipstick excuse me berry color lip liner and you are fine like at least for me I was fine so I'm not gonna put it on because I don't my lips are not prepped for anything and y'all gonna be like what you trying to do cuz that is not cute yes y'all will tell me that so I'm just gonna swatch it for you guys it looks silvery greenish brownish purplish it's it's a color y'all like it's this is a color right here this is some you you got the you got to wear this color you can't be scared that's all I got to say I love the packaging on it it's got her little got her little thing on here y'all know how I feel about Rihanna just, mm, okay but um it's got the packaging her writing on here yeah I like her packaging too. Yeah, it's red. Feels like velvet. You go, girl. Happy for you, boo boo. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, back. So, and I also heard shh, 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 that Miley Cyrus is supposed to be the next Viva Glam campaigner. I can't wait. They said her colors is crazy. I was like, yes, yes, Miley. I like Miley. I do. I I like Miley. That's I root for Miley. Even though she's crazy, I don't care. Because I think she was crazy before she became the crazy that we see now. That's what I'm saying. But this color, let me get a a purplish kind of um There we go. So the purple is on one side. And I mean, I work at a makeup store, so when I wear this, they're going to be like, yes, she pulled it off. We couldn't do it. <laughs> and then there's going to be, so I use, this is by Clean Color Violet. I use this one. That's how purple it is. So you can actually see the specs. There's specks of color in there that bring out with whichever lip liner that you use if you put this on flat you're gonna look crazy unless that's the look you're going for honey and this is more of a berry color I mixed mine with the berry color before I mixed it with the purple because the purple I mean the berry is what I did in the Mac store and I like defined my V and did like kind of like a little ombre like I just did the edges and just put the color in the middle it was gorgeous. Oh, oh my God! You guys just oh, oh my goodness. So that's what I used, and that was the original price. As the rest of them, it was sixteen. I was thinking it was gonna be like you know, eighteen or twenty some. Somebody's text me, but that's I rather you put it with a berry color lip liner, and I also got from Mac this lip liner pencil called Naked Liner. And it's like a neutral. 
So I'm going to use this and then go back in with a brown lip pencil and create. I'm going to have to do it with this, um, this kind of berry color here because I don't have a brown one at the moment. Go back in with the brown lip pencil and create my lip. And then go over it with a, um, ooh, I like that though. Go over it with a matte neutral lip stick, kind of the same as that color. I don't have a brown one at the moment, but that's, that's the initial plan for this lip pencil here. So that's it with the NYX Retractable Lip Liner in Plum. This is plum. And yes, if I wore that, just like if I wear this out, this lipstick and then this lip liner, I can't like wear it by itself because I'm going to look like I have ashy, nasty lips. So That ain't cute for nobody. <laughs> Alright, you guys. So, that is not it. What am I doing? I got this from... Where did I get this from? This is from Kmart. The Glazed Lip Paint by LA Girl. Got it for $3.49 in the red one. And this is in the color Pinup. Yeah, yeah. The glazed lip paint. And then this is from the Beauty Spa store. So this is by Ruby Kisses Lip Lacquer. And it is blue lip gloss, y'all. And it did not stain my lips. But the color, I only needed one application. I didn't even have to put any on the top of my lips. I just put it on the bottom. So, and I put it together. It dries glossy, yet it doesn't move around. So, yeah, this is some good stuff. And on that note, I love you guys. And I will see you guys later. Read your Romans 116. And I will be back at you guys with some more videos. That's my mommy. <laughs> Bye, you guys. Love you guys. Thank you for tuning in. And I will be back at you.